couple months I'll be taking off to do a portion of the Arizona Trail and I'd like to show you what my gear looks like so let's check it out. First up is my Gossamer Gear uh, Mariposa pack. It's a 60 liter including all these pockets and let me just take a trip around it here. I'll be cold soaking. That's uh, eating your food cold, uh, so no stove. Um, so all of my all of my food essentially goes in here with some water. Shake it up, put it in the back of my pack for a little while, and about you know within minutes, sometimes maybe an hour, uh, my meal will be ready. I can just keep hiking when I stop, eat, go. That's the deal. Cold soaking. Need lots of water in Arizona, so I'm gonna bring one liter here. I have one more that I'll carry uh, in my my front um, strap. And then I have two two liter pouches, one platypus, and one knock. So, oh, and my uh, I'm gonna try this Catadine. Um, be free filter. I've heard a lot of good things about it, so I'm going to check it out. Offer some recommendations from some other folks. Um, out of character for me because I usually bring along a whole sterilization kit. Uh, this is a filter, so we'll see how it goes, but I'm curious. And there's a few other miscellaneous things. Um, I gotta bring a first aid kit, right, and some toiletries. And my trowel and some other toiletry stuff. Got to take a ditty bag with some string or some cord in there and some um, repair kit. Um, a little fire kit in case I want to build a fire. I usually don't, but there you go. And um, one interesting thing when you get into the deserty areas, uh, umbrella is pretty nice. Not just to keep you uh, out of the rain, but also to keep you out of the sun. So this one's a little chrome one, so it. Uh, reflects the sun. It's supposed to keep you a lot of cooler. I'm going to check it out. And who can do without electronics? Not this guy. So, um, a few things here. We have my uh, Garmin Explorer emergency device. My charger for my batteries for my uh, for my camera. This is my only flashlight. Anchor 10,000. Uh, an extra sand disc. My phone. And I'm going to take this uh, solar strip. Instead of staying in town and waiting like a half day to charge everything, I'm just going to charge while I'm on the trail. Since I'm in Arizona, it should be sunny. That's what I'm hoping for. But that's all my electronics. That's it. Clothes. Gotta have them. So here's what I'm taking with me. Um, my Helium 2 rain jacket. My Helium 2 rain pants, which I normally just wear at night. My... Uh, Patagonia Nano Puffy. I like that. At night, I'll be sleeping in some long johns. Just some medium weight stuff. And then I have a merino wool long jacket, uh, long shirt here. So, keeps me nice and warm at night. And when my feet get cold, I have these uh, down, down footies. They work really nice, keep my feet warm. Um, extra pair of socks. Um, some gloves. A little, um, a little neck gaiter. And uh, that's about it. Those are my clothes. That, my friends, is how I set up a tent. 
And last but not least, we have to have a place to sleep. And so my sleeping system includes a small eighth inch um, foam pad underneath to try to keep the uh, anything from uh, puncturing my air mattress. My air mattress here is here's an insulated sea to summit. And I have a local Libre, uh, I think it's a, a ghost pepper 20 degree down quilt. That's what I use, and I also have a climate pillow, so um, that's where I'm going with all this. This is uh, this is my whole gear setup right here. So, hope you enjoyed it. Hope it helped out. I also have an article that I posted on my blog. Go check that out. All the links down below. So for all this stuff. All right. So hope you enjoyed it. See you soon.